Finally, I get the remote. What's your pop new YouTube? It's your girl Diana back with another YouTube video. As you can see by the title, I'm going to be doing a trends slash just record things that should be left in 2019. This is my third one because I did one in 2017, 2018, and now we're doing it again for 2019. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to be part of the hashtag day amount because if you're not with the gang, you can't hang in. This video is sponsored by LED LED projector. And I'm gonna give you guys more um, more information on this like during the video, like in the middle of the video. But I just wanted to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by this baby right here. Without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. I have a disclaimer. This is also like an unpopular opinions video. So just because I feel that these should um like be left in 2019 that doesn't mean you should feel that way too so therefore if you have a problem with what i'm saying i that ass don't care and that's it like i don't care if you feel away i i just don't care i don't care so y'all remember last like y'all remember the first year it was just me personally and then the second year was when i had when you guys had told me like my subscribers on youtube had told me what you know they feel that should be left in 2019 now this year i had um posted on instagram so this is my instagram followers but i only picked out the ones that i agree with so the ones that they said that i did not agree with i just i left it alone okay so the first one is the new disney channel shows because this new generation with these new shows it's not it like it's not even funny no more like it's just it's not it not next thing that i think that should be left in 2019 which i thought we left in 2018 because i said this last year but no i still be seeing people in school with these shoes on and i'm pretty sure you already know what shoes i'm talking about and it's these chunky feelers it's not it stop it stop it stop it like why all right they so ugly like what's your motive what's your motive with these sneakers i don't get it i don't get it I don't get it okay. so the next thing is the visco girls versus the e-girls like at first it was funny like what, what was it sk, sk, sk. lol lol um the scrunchies and all of that and then the e-girl was like like it was funny at first but like it's not it no more stop it stop it stop it it's just it's an act like like some people just forcing it like what y'all to force it for like like what's going on be yourself what the hell the next thing which which this brings me to tiktok i can't even say this should be left in 2019 because i said musically should be left in i think 2017 or 2018 it was one of them videos and i said that again for tiktok 2018 but it's still alive i guess like you're just not gonna get rid of it mad tiktok videos on instagram and some of them be funny like the one that they share on instagram be funny so i was like okay so i downloaded the app and i was watching videos I was like, this is corny, but this is funny. It's corny, but this is funny. So, I don't know about TikTok anymore. Like, I don't know. Because some of them, some people on there is actually funny. But some is just like, they, they just be doing too much. So, I don't know what to say about that one. So, y'all gotta let me know. Because I, I just, I don't care. It comes in like this little baggie. You're gonna need this plug. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it. It comes with like a little remote. I don't have the batteries to put in it, so I decided to use the like button physically. They don't come with um, batteries as well as the little cord that you need to connect to your phone. This is the front and it comes with like a cover. And then this is to like push it out, like zoom out. And then this is to like, I think focus it or something like that. So you could just play around with it until like it fits the screen or the wall how you want it to go right here you can see it turned on here we go you gotta press you gotta make sure you press this button oh a little but you gotta make sure you hold this button after you plug it in this is to turn it on see i can see it on the wall oh so that was me showing you guys how to like open it as um like i said before if you want to connect it to your phone and actually like play movies on it, you will need um, a special cord. So all of the information will be in the description. 
as well as this product and just check them out so yeah but the next thing that should be left in 2019 is these black air forces like if you wear them black air forces next to me just like get away from me because my brother have them my brother have them and he be trying to wear them like when we going out he be like should i wear my black air forces i said yo you dangerous like you crazy like you crazy so that should just be left in 2019 if you want to get those for work shoes or like if you go to a charter school please get another sneakers another black sneaker not the air force one not the black not the black nasty which brings me to harachis oh my god oh it's just bad drip harachis is just bad drip like they comfortable and all and maybe you could just wear them for maybe maybe you could just wear them for um for a gym or shit like that but harachis is bad drip it's I hate to say it but it's bad it's these toxic relationships slash toxic energy like you know you can have like me if we date it it's gonna be a little toxic but you're gonna love it here like you really gonna love it here it's gonna be a little toxic it's a little toxic you're gonna love it you're gonna love it here you're gonna love it here and you're not going with nobody else period but that that toxic could you know stay that type of toxic but the talk score is like you unhappy all day, you never smiling, bad energy, bad vibe, friendship relationships, friendships, family, all of that. It's just not it. Like we don't need to bring bad energy such bad vibes to 2020, even though we said this in 2019. We just don't need to bring it in 2020. The lack of self-confidence. Y'all always ask me, how do I like keep up my confidence? How do I like, you know, just have so much confidence and how do I keep it up? How do I not give up about what everybody else has to say about me? I just don't care. I just don't care. I don't. So I don't know how to explain that to y'all. I just don't care. I just, like, you can say some smart shit, and I'm going to come back to you with some smart shit. And that's that. And it's not like I took what you said to me to heart. It's just that I just don't care. And I'm going to just say what I want to say to you because you want to... Like, you felt like you had to say something to me that was negative, so I'm gonna just come at you back. Just tell yourself you're beautiful, because I was insecure about my body, but now I don't give a fuck, because I'm still bagging niggas, and that's period. Bad lace fronts. Like, when I get my lace fronts, and they start looking bad, like the edges, and the, it just start looking bad, I just take that shit off. Like, stop trying to save what you can't save, baby. If it's starting to look bad, just take it off, mama. Just take it off, because it's not... It's not gonna look cute anymore. The next thing that um should be left out, but I don't know about, I would say Fortnite, but really I don't care about Fortnite no more. Like my brother really loves that game and some some boys don't even play that game like as often anymore because they just like it's the same shit over and over again. So I don't really care about Fortnite. I just put it on this list because I know a lot of females will say like oh Fortnite needs to be left back, da da da, because they need attention. But if your man not giving you attention over a game, don't give him attention. Go do something else. Just like that. Me, I would just go watch Netflix, and then when they ready to text me, maybe I'll text back. But since you want to play Fortnite, I'm going to text you when I want to text you back. That's it. Oh my god, I am so tired of seeing two stripe Adidas and the four stripe Adidas. Please, if it's not Adidas, with the three stripes and it says Adidas, don't wear it. Don't wear it. Like, I be seeing some girls with the li the little two piece, like the two piece set, the top, and the bottom, and it's just like two stripes on the side. I don't like that. I feel like that personally is bad. Next one, I know. Oh my God, I know y'all gonna come at me for this one. I know y'all gonna come at me for this one. But look, I dead ass don't care. I dead ass don't care. I don't care. I don't care. So with that being said, NBA trash nigga young boy should stay in 2019. Dirty Iana. Uh huh. That shit was ass. It was ass. Get out of here. Like y'all really bumping that. Like you shitting me. No, I don't like him. He got like mad babies. He got like mad baby mothers. He got herpes. He got all of this. Like, why y'all? That's y'all king. That's y'all king. Y'all shit me. Y'all dead ass. That's y'all king. I don't care. Like, mad of y'all is fans of him and shit like that. But in my opinion, which you click to see because it's my opinion, I think 
he's overrated. He should be left in 2019. He shouldn't die. But like, he's overhyped. The hype need to bring down on that because what's going on. The next thing that should be left in 2019 is chokers. Like, who even wear chokers anymore? The only chokers that I'll probably wear is a little, um, the... The one with the rhinestones and then it has like the little thing coming down and like you can wear like a shirt that's like a little revealing so that they can see the thing going. The next thing that should be left in 2019 and this goes for mostly the girls but it could go for the boys too. Like uh, like stop accepting what's less than your worth. Like if somebody not treating you right, get out my life because you're not worth it to be in my life so get out. So like if you got anybody that's like not treating you right and you feel like if they don't know how to appreciate you they don't know they don't understand um how much you're worth suck my dick that's it get out my life period so as that the next thing the next thing i think i said this last year too but y'all still continuing this it's and it's black fishing so if you don't know what that is it's basically like when white people put on makeup or whatever and like make themselves look black or some shit like that it's some shit like that that should just be left in 2019 like didn't um didn't gucci like come out with like a product that was like a face mask some shit i don't know but all of that you know just like what's your motive what's your point of that like what's going on like i don't understand so some of the some people on the on my thing said ig dancers like instagram dancers I don't think that whole thing should be left in 2019. I just feel like the drama should be left in 2019. Because why y'all having drama for? Stop embarrassing yourselves with these little back and forth um, Instagram tweets or whatever. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but I know what I'm trying to say. So just the drama between Instagram dances just need to be left in 2019. The next thing that should be left in 2019 is leave outs. Because a lot of y'all leave outs be looking bad. If your hair color don't match, or if your hair texture don't match, and you, you know your hair when it's straight and it don't look silky like the hair, please don't do a leave out. It's not gonna look cute. You won't. The next nice thing that should be left in 2019 is procrastination. Like I already started to like stop being um lazy. Like I just woke up this morning. I was like, I'm gonna make a video. Same thing that happened yesterday. I'll make a video. When I come home from school, I'm gonna do my homework. I already started like preparing myself for 2020 to stop being lazy and just get shit done. Girls fighting over boys when the boys don't even want you. Like, if you a girl and somebody like, and if you like, let's say your ex, right? Like it's another girl. Now all of a sudden you don't like the girl because your ex like the girl. Like you're mad, weird, and that's mad immature because that's your ex for a reason. So, y'all need to stop fighting over these little boys because most of them just want to fuck anyways. So, y'all fighting and they over here laughing because if it was them, if it was them like wanting you, they wouldn't be fighting over you. They would just be laughing like, all right, you can have her, you can have her, bro, you can have her. Like, I don't know why y'all girls be fighting over niggas that don't even care about y'all. Y'all weird. Something else that should be left in 2019 is cheating. If you don't want to be with the person, why are you with them? Or like, if you're with the person and you cheat because there's just something wrong about them, but like you still want to be with them, but you just want to do that over there on that side, you're wrong. And cheating to just stop. Like we get way too old for all of this cheating. If you don't want to be with the person, just let them know, let them go, and move but on. The next thing that should be left in 2019, which I don't know if I fully agree with but this is something that maybe you guys might agree with so this is the only reason why i'm saying this and it's the hairstyle full of butterfly clips i mean if you don't put too much like od then and it look cute then yeah you can do it but some people just be od like they have it all over all 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 over the hair is full of it like there's a like you could put it to a certain extent where it's gonna look cute I don't know and I don't care about it because I don't wear it so I that I don't care. The next thing that should be left in 2019 is spray ground. Like I left that in eighth grade. So if you were in high school and you got a spray ground, I mean do you, but in my opinion, spray ground should be left in 2019 because it's like the hype is over. 
And now looking back at it, it's just like childish backpacks and childish bags. Maybe that's because I'm maturing and I like more more like expensive stuff now and like cuter stuff and like I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but in my opinion, I feel that spring on should be left in 2019. The next thing that should be left in 2019 is discrimination and deportation. Because we need everybody in here because like like yo, I don't understand I, don't, I never understood that because if we had all Americans in America, it wouldn't be America. Cause like, like I get if you don't have your papers and all of that, then yeah, you should be sent back. But like, at least give them some time to get it or something. I don't know. Not just deported, deported like that. Like, and there's a lot of things and that's happening in China. I don't know the whole story about it. But it's like the families and kids getting locked up and in, in, in cages and stuff like that. All of that needs to be left in 2019 and we need to make a change because that's something that people is not talking about. Discrimination, deportation, all of these people getting locked up in cages in these countries. Like, next thing that should not be coming with me to 2019 and that should be, I mean to 2020 and that should be left in 2019 is these people with no goals. If you have no goals in life, and you just here with me get the fuck out because me i have a lot of goals and i plan on reaching them goals so if you're just there sitting there like oh ah da da get out of my face because everybody should have goals that they want to achieve if you don't have no goals in life or at all and all you want to do is gang bang and suck they get out of my face i'm the wrong person to be friends with because i don't have time for that I make money and I like to make money. And if you don't like to make money, get out. Or if you don't like to think about what what you're gonna do in life to make money, get out of here. Cause like, what's your motive? Cause we're going to school to get a education so that we can use that education to get bread in life. So if you're not, if you don't know what you wanna do, then get to the next thing that should be left in 2019 is comparing women to each other. Like comparing Nikki and Cardi, like I'm both. I love both of them. What's your motive? What's your point of comparing females? Like, it's just society. That's just how females are. I just so petty. I so petty. Why can't we just support one another? Like, y'all just so petty. The last thing that I feel that should be left in 2019 is these friendly niggas. If we dating and you have the nerves to be friendly with these other bitches, get out of here because I don't have time for that. Like. Don't be afraid of my man. Y'all girls too. If you have a boyfriend, why are you friendly with these other niggas? That's weird. Me? Like I said, it's gonna be a little toxic over here, but you're gonna love it. Which brings me to both of us not being friendly. Like, we could be, you know, not friendly as in not be all up on niggas, play fighting and shit like that when your man is right there or when your girl is right there. So it'd be like a high and a buy and a little talk. But other than that, stop with the friendly shit. Stop entertaining niggas. Stop entertaining bitches. And that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, this was my unpopular opinions on what should um, be left in 2019. So if you don't agree with it, I dead ass don't. Kid. Don't forget to check out. <laughs> don't forget to check out lead projector everything will be in the description and they have videos on how to set it up so if you don't know how to set it up it's going to be in the description and the website and all of that will be in the description don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to be a part of the hashtag day if you're not with the gig you can hang out see you guys in my next video